there, bots and babes. Welcome to the 24th edition of the Misty Minute, a weekly YouTube series where I talk about things happening in the world of MST3K, Rift Tracks, uh, Agony Wolf Media, etc., etc. I have a special um, enter to win opportunity for you guys, so let's do it. Let's dive right into the Misty Minute. Here's what's happening in the world of the fans. You and me and all us Misties together. Uh, one of the things happening is a weekly online uh, watch together that yours truly personally hosts. The amazing Colossal Watch Together Guide. We're going through important um, episodes of MST3K. This week uh, we will be watching Soul Taker because it includes a guest appearance from Joel and from uh, Trace. Uh, Agony Wolf Media, formerly known as Incognito Cinema Warriors, has... Um, lots of great game riffing up on their YouTube series. I want you to head over there and watch some of their stuff. Click subscribe and give them a like. The MST3K Revival League podcast. They recently uh, interviewed Mark Frazier from Samurai Cop 1 and Samurai Cop 2. They talked to him about that and as well as um, a Kickstarter that he had going on. Let's see. The Again, online, the MST3K and more online watch together. Every week, we uh, we watch pretty much online 24-7, but every weekend, we have different themes. This coming weekend, we'll be watching To the Stars. We're going to watch Star Wars and Star Trek movies. And then, excuse me, Saturday and Sunday, it's going to be Monster Mayhem. So lots of nice, scary rubber monsters for you. All right, people actually meeting up in person. Let's talk about what's happening with the MST3K UK. The folks over there in London, they have recently just got the uh, Rift Tracks guys, did some live riffing, and now Frank and Trace are going to be part of... Uh, Sci-Fi London's Festival. So, uh, let's see, May 5th, they're going to be over there. There's an Indiegogo that you can help um, contribute to that to get some cool uh, prizes. And there's also a GoFundMe if you just want to give them some money to help cover the costs that they've got going on over there. Let's see. In Fairfax, Virginia, there is a Midnight MST3K where they're going to be watching, uh, I don't know what they're watching this coming week, but fr this Friday, March 2nd, if you're in Virginia, you definitely want to go check it out. It's five bucks. You get to watch it in a real theater. That's pretty damn cool. Uh, da -da 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 -da. Okay, let's talk about live riffing where you go and uh, watch someone else riff um, that aren't you know, part of MST3K. In Seattle, Washington, happening March 2nd, this Friday, is Mystery Drag Queen Theater 3000. They're going to be, uh, there's a group of drag queens who are going to be watching EGA and riffing through that. Uh, down in front in Chicago, Illinois, March 6th, they're going to be riffing through the Breakfast Club. And go and mark your calendar for March 15th, where they're having a riff along, where you as the audience get to participate in the riffing as well. Uh, Cinemasochist on March 13th, they're going to, they're in Kansas City, Missouri. They're going to be riffing uh, Turbulence 3, Heavy Metal. And if you're in Atlanta, Georgia, be sure to check out Cineprov. Uh, this coming Thursday, March 1st, they're going to be riffing Bailout. And then on April 5th, which is next month, they're going to be riffing Prisoners of the Lost Universe. So you won't want to miss out on that. The new segment I introduced last week, Fan Follow. Thank you, Jamie, for being the inaugural fan. Uh, this time we're going to follow up with Zachary Smith. He does a lot of great uh, graphic design art that I've seen, fan art. So I want you to head over to his Twitter and follow him and support him. Uh, the MST3K Lego set, don't forget, please go vote for this. Um, it's running out of days and we need some signatures. Of course, the monthly... Uh, Postcard Exchange Experiment P is happening. You can sign up uh, for March and go ahead and exchange postcards with Misty's around the country and around the world. So I think uh, I think that's it for the fans. Uh, if you know of something happening, if you're hosting a meetup, I'd love to be able to tell folks about it. Just uh, shoot me an email and um, I'll let everybody know. Let's talk about what's happening with the cast and crew, the alumni of our beloved MST3K. Uh, one person who, you know, never really was on the show, but she kind of sort of was, uh, Jackie Neiman Jones, who was Little Debbie in Manos, Hands of Fate. Not, she has lots of stuff going on. She's written a book. Uh, she has a podcast, Jackie's Hand of Horror. And coming in April, she'll be in Ohio at the Cinema Wasteland Movie and Memorabilia Expo. But the big news that came out of Manos... Uh, 
realm this week is the world premiere of Manos Returns. If you are lucky enough to be in Seattle at Crypticon on May 4th, please go get your tickets so you can be one of the first to see Manos Returns, which is the sequel to Manos, The Hands of Fate. It's not a remake, it's, it's a sequel. So if you're cool enough to be living in Seattle, you can go check that out. You definitely should. Other big news that happened is Rift Tracks 2018 Kickstarter has uh, was announced on Tuesday, and they were funded today. They got there you know, within less than a week. They were able to reach their goal, so I'm sure they'll be having a lot more stretch goals. They're going to be riffing a uh, live riffing Space Mutiny uh, in June, and then Cruel in August. Maybe we'll get a third movie. The more people throw money at them, which would be awesome. Uh, one of their full uh, they released a new full length riff called Son of Sinbad. It's over there for you to pick up at rifttracks.com. Uh, Michael J. Nelson and Connor Lestoker, one of the Connor, Connor Lestoka, I'm sorry. Uh, one of the writers from Rift Tracks, they have a podcast called 372 Pages We'll Never Get Back. They're reading through Ernest Klein's uh, Armada, which is a follow up to Ready Player One. They release new episodes uh, of the podcast every Friday. Now, speaking of the things you can win, Connor Lestoka has written another book, The Pole Vault Champion of the entire universe and he has been so awesome to offer up an autographed copy for my viewers so there's gonna be two ways to enter this you can either comment on this video here on Facebook or excuse me on YouTube or when I put out a special tweet you can like and retweet that and that'll get you in the drawing I don't know what deadline I'm gonna put on it yet uh, probably like two weeks. But yes, you could win your own autographed, personalized autographed copy of Connor Lestoka's new book, uh, The Pole Vault Championship of the Universe. If you don't want to wait, go ahead and pick it up. You can pick up a copy. I've got the link down there for you to follow. Frank Conniff, as you know, he's got some books and he's always active on a uh, Sirius XM Insight Channel 121. And if you want to go ahead and mark your calendars for March 14th, if you are in Astoria, New York, uh, March 14th, like I said, he'll be doing a cartoon dump where I think they sit there and riff uh, bad old cartoons. So that's really cool as well. Uh, Frank Conniff and Trace Ballou of the Mads are back. They are doing some touring. They just finished up in Portland. This coming week, they're going to be in Greenwich, Rhode Island and in Arlington, Massachusetts. Go ahead and mark your calendars if you're in Ashburn, Virginia for March 23rd. That's they'll be the next stop for them. They also have their podcast, Movie Sign with the Mads, um, with Carolina Hildago. Uh, they recently reviewed Black Panther as well as Mother, so you want to go give those a listen over on SoundCloud. Follow the link. Jonah Ray, this coming Monday, so in about a week, he's going to be doing some stand-up as a promotion for Paige Weldon's new album. Uh, so if you're in L.A., you can definitely check him out. And he has a podcast called Jonah Radio uh, that releases new episodes all the time, so you'll want to check that out. Hampton Yunt has uh, his podcast, Suicide Buddies, where he and Dave Ross talk about people who have killed themselves. This week, they actually uh, had in one of my new Hollywood crushes, uh, Jake Wiseman, I don't hope I'm saying that right, of Corporate, which is on Comedy Central. So let me tell you about Corporate. Baron Vaughn is also in this show called Corporate on Comedy Central. It's hysterical. I love it. Just found out they're going to get uh, a season two, so that is great. Um, it's a really depressing comedy, but I promise it's it's worth a watch. Baron is also on uh, Grace and Frankie over there on Netflix. Felicia Day, busy lady. Uh, she has been on uh, a recurring character on Sci-Fi's The Magicians. Coming up this weekend, she will be at the Emerald City Comic Con in Seattle. April 6th through 8th, she'll be in Dallas at the Fan Expo. Let's see, May 18th to the 20th, she'll be in Poland at a Comic Con there. And then again, May 25th to the 27th, she'll be at the London Comic Con. So, she is out there touring. Go get your picture taken with her. Pat Oswald, he has that show AP Bio uh, on NBC. You want to check that out. Uh, Grandpa Choco. Please go support him, uh, Mr. Waverly. He has a YouTube channel called Saturday Morning Media. You'll want to check that out. He also has a podcast called Under the Puppet, where he recently uh, interviewed Tim Blaney, who is also part of Season 11 of MST3K. So you'll want to give that one a listen as well. I think that's it for the cast and crew. Um, if you have a sighting, let me know. I'd love to tell everybody. 
here's what's happening in merchandise. Uh, the MST3K, you can go ahead and pre-order the box set of singles and get an exclusive poster. These are classic MST3K episodes that were never released as a box set, though they are able to be released. Um, and I believe the Blu-ray Season 11, if you hadn't already gotten it uh, or received it, it should be available in April, so that's just a few months away. Huzzah! Shout Factory, if you didn't know, all orders over $50 get you free shipping and we've come to find out that we will be getting some new classic episodes to Netflix on March 15th. They're going to be swapping out the uh, MST3K classic episodes that have been online for a year now. So we'll get some <clears throat> old new <laughs> episodes for us to enjoy. Think Geek has some cool uh, merchandise over there. Jonah's silhouette on a mug. They got a great blanket that's super soft and I love it. They also have a nice little apron and oven mitt. Zen Monkey Studios, we have some new pens. Yes, they, we have pen. This is one of the older pens, but we now have a Mike pen and a Jonah pen. So now all three hosts have their own pens. So that's super awesome. Um, and you can check out their products, you know, online or you can go through Amazon. They will also be at Emerald City Comic Con coming up, so maybe you can stop by their booth and uh, pick up some some merchandise from them. So, I think that's it. Uh, yeah, be sure to comment on this YouTube video so you can be entered to in, win an autographed copy of Connor Stoker's new book. Uh, I want to help spread the word far and wide for him. So, do that. Please and thank you. Love and riffs. Captain Dolphin out. <laughs> <laughs>